Tucked away in a corner of Circuit Road Hawker Center, Dancing Cha Kwai Tio is one of the quirkiest Kwai Tio stalls 8days.sg has ever come across. Like its name implies, the stall's owner, Chi Wei Leong, 68, puts on quite the show as he dances while whipping up plates of healthier cha kwai tio. Despite his age, uncle is rather agile, shimming to the beat of cha cha music as he cooks. The jovial hawker sways his hips, sidesteps and bobs up and down, well, as best as he can for someone who's busy frying cha kwai tio, all while expertly tossing his noodles in the wok. Fascinating. But impressive dancing skills aside, he's also popular for his unique riffs on the local cha kwai tio. Each plate is topped with a soft boiled egg or an omelette. And Wei Liang claims to be the first in Singapore to offer these dishes. Slaving over a wok is already a hearty workout on its own, so we can't help but wonder, why is this uncle dancing while he's cooking? Does he have an insatiable passion for dance? Or is this his way of attracting more customers? Wei Liang laughs as he clarifies that he's not exactly dancing, he's just trying to do some exercise. He explains, the doctor asked me to exercise more and I have no time. So I try to move around in my stall instead. He tells us that he picked up ballroom dancing when he was 40 as a hobby, and his favorite dance is the cha-cha. As such, he usually alternates between playing cha-cha music and instrumental songs, explaining that if they're singing it becomes very noisy, like a KTV. On Facebook, Wei Liang explicitly states that his cha kwai tio is not the original black, oily and sweet cha kwai tio, but is the second generation type. He inherited his recipe from his father, who ran the stall for 45 years before passing the reins to him in 2005. According to Wei Liang, his cooking style is different from his dad's. He uses less oil, but gets the better quality and pricier knife brand oil, and cooks his kwai tio in an icon billis stock loaded with nutritious ingredients like cabbage, corn and onions. What's more, he also offers his cha kwai tio with an omelette or softballed egg, which is extremely unusual as the hawker dish is usually served with scrambled style eggs. Intrigued by Moonlight Hall Fun Which has a raw egg cracked over freshly cooked kwai tio, Wei Liang says he first saw raw eggs on noodles in Malaysia, but not in cha kwai tio. It got him thinking about how he could adapt Moonlight Hall Fun to make his own version of CKT. This is a totally raw egg, but when I returned to Singapore I was thinking, if you put a raw egg on cha kwai tio, it becomes inedible, he laughs. He later fine-tuned his idea after being inspired by Yakuan Kaya Toast softballed eggs and decided to incorporate it into his kwai tio. It became quite a hit among his customers, and he now sells up to 60 plates of it daily. As Wei Liang is 68 this year, he tells us that he wants to retire by 70, but can't find a successor to take over his shop. The girl that laments, my children are all daughters, and they don't want to do this kind of tough job. He has tried looking for outsiders to take over his stall but shares that nobody has approached me so far. Dancing Cha Kwai Tio has a no-frills for item menu. Wei Liang serves normal Cha Kwai Tio $3.50, half-bought egg Kwai Tio $4. Fried egg Kwai Tio $4.50 and a combo fried and half-bought egg Kwai Tio $5.50. Our smoky plate of cha kwai tio was less greasy and sweet than the typical CKT, but was umami enough with pretty robust wok hay. It comes topped with fresh juicy cockles, bouncy fish cake slices, crunchy toga and salty slivers of LUP chong. The star of the show is the wobbly softball egg that bursts and coats the rice noodles, 
so we get rich. Runny egg yolk, with each bite. The chili here is different from other stalls too, instead of sambal, Wei Liang offers a more watery, but punchy chicken rice style chili sauce that's fairly spicy. For this dish, Wei Liang fries up an omelette before breaking it into bite sized pieces and adding kuai teo and other ingredients. The result is a textural dish reminiscent of ORH look. Though we prefer the soft boiled egg CKT, the semi cooked yolk adds more eggy flavor to the dish than the blender, drier omelette.